<laughs> all right, all right. So, so you, so you wrote the Heisenberg obituary. Uh, obituary. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you used the picture of the old Walt. Okay. The teacher Walt. Okay. And I end up going to uh, online, started typing it all out. It comes to mortuary name and mortuary phone number. I'm like, I don't know. So I used my, I just said home and used my own phone number. So I ended up putting it in and I get an email back and it says, you need to fix these things before we can submit it. Uh, so I call and I, there's this lady, 99 years old, 99 feet under the ground. Obituary. And I said, uh, yes, ma'am, I'm Dave Lehman. I'm contacting you about the Walter White obituary. And she says, yes. And I said, there's some things about the mortuary name and number. I, I don't have that. She said, well, is the body at the OMI? I said, no, no, ma'am, no. Well, do you have a death certificate? And I went, that's a brilliant idea, a death certificate. <laughs> No, no, ma'am. I said, Walter White was from Breaking Bad that was filmed here, and I want to honor him. Uh, we don't print jokes. I said, it's not a joke. I really want to do this. And so fortunately, her boss was a huge fan and said, that's a brilliant idea. Let's do it. Nice. And it was the only time ever in Albuquerque that the journal has sold out. People were yeah. stealing the papers. I remember that. Uh, it became a huge deal. I remember that. And um, I had no idea. You know, I was thinking, oh, this is cute for Albuquerque. Well, I wake up in the morning and I hear on the radio, I usually don't look at obituaries, but this one I'm saving. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> it was funny because the lady that was at the obituary, the boss, um, she says, okay, I'm not going to put it in the obituary section. Right. But I'll have to do it as an ad. So then my wife was mad because it was expensive. <laughs> it was like 200 bucks for Dang, this little thing. right? And she's like, that's so stupid. Well, my wife and I were teachers. We don't make money like that. I don't have money like that to spend. <laughs> oh, she was so mad. I said, well, babe, it's a once in a lifetime thing. Let's just do it and it'll be cool. Well, then she found out how appreciated it was and it became right. a major thing for people. Right. And uh, then I made t-shirts. Oh, I didn't, I have, I couldn't have worn them mine today. Um, postcards, magnets. I gave um, Aaron Paul when he was here a couple weeks ago. I gave right. him that. Oh, he goes, that's cool. You did that? You did that? That's cool. That's and cool. Vince, um, and Vince even said it was brilliant. And yeah. when Vince tells you it's brilliant, right. that's like God telling you. Yeah, it's Vince brilliant. Gilligan, man. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, it was a fun thing. And um, I've talked to Walt, of course, Brian. Right. And um, I gave him some obituary stuff. And when I saw him, last time he says i thought i remembered you I'm like yeah 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 that's awesome because so, you uh, were on season one yep season the one pilot and then also season two episode 10 i'm in um at the racks and then uh, my truck also not only was it at racks but it was just filmed in uh this last season of better call saul episode seven at the route 66 casino when Lalo comes pulling in. Nice, nice. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. Oh, and Betsy Brandt, when she found it, she goes, how come you didn't make an obituary for Hank? I said, he hasn't been found yet. <laughs> ah, right? smart. Thinking on your toes. Yep. Nice. So it was pretty cool. Nice. It was a lot of fun. Right on.